12 on Health now and a feel good Friday story for you. This evening, a local woman is sharing how surgery solved her painful shoulder condition. Here's 12 on Health reporter Gillian Nett. Guys, I don't know what helped this woman more, shoulder surgery or her attitude. A few things to know about the woman on the right, Gabrielle Thorpe of Norwalk. She is not exactly 87. She's 87 and a half. Years young. <laughs> she will not slow down. There's nothing that I can't do. I'm very active and I like to do what I want to do when I want to do it. That's a heavy thing to let go all around. And she's not willing to go through life Holy mackerel! with a bum shoulder. Very painful. If I lift it up here and I had a glass, it would drop. Her problem is actually in the joint. There was no cushioning or cartilage left between these two bones. And that's what happens in arthritis. People lose cartilage. That creates what we call bone-on-bone -bone pain. Dr. Seth Miller of Orthopedic and Neurosurgery Specialists in Greenwich recommended surgery. She said, bring it. In the surgery, the metal ball is secured into the bone with a short stem. On the other side, we have the plastic socket. And together, they form a joint so that when she moves her arm, it's free to glide and move without pain. Can you reach sideways a little bit? Yep. Good. With surgery behind her and with intense physical therapy. Backhand. She wouldn't have it any other way. <laughs> Surf. Thorpe is ready to rock. Dr. Miller says Thorpe was lucky to be a candidate for standard shoulder surgery. Other patients may need more elaborate surgery if they have both arthritis and torn muscle and ligaments surrounding the joint and the rotator cuff. For more information, just go to our website, news12.com. Oh, wonderful attitude. That definitely yeah, helps things as well. She's not slowing down. She's for awesome. <laughs> we'll see her on the court soon. Yes.